Hallöchen, Hallöchen, Hallöchen. Herzlich willkommen zurück zu Bear with Me Episode 2. Wir sind nur noch Teddy Bear, weil Amber wird im Casino festgehalten. Und äh, wir haben aber immer noch nicht. Äh, wir wollen jetzt mit. Looks like a garage. Ted zu I am Tigrin. Haben wir denn schon alles? Moment, wir gucken Couldn't mal. Couldn't be clearer. Ja, genau. Äh, warte mal. Wir haben Fischgräten für Wasser. Haha. Alright. Worked. Judging by that sound design cue, I'd say it fits. <lacht> okay. Ähm, wir haben eine Feder für Luft. This would actually make sense if I was a lunatic. But let's play ball for now. Okay. Äh, wir haben Streichhölzer für Feuer. There. I guess that's right. Was haben wir jetzt noch? Erde. Für Erde haben wir eine Pflanze. There you go, little buddy. So, und die Liebe, da haben wir natürlich Tigrins Medaillon. Maybe this will work. Ja. Und dann geht diese Tür auf. Hmm. I thought the obvious door would open. Didn't really expect the wall to open. Na, das hat man aber hat man aber gut gesehen. The Fifth Element haben wir gerade als Versteck bekommen, äh, als Versteck, als Achievement bekommen und wir gehen in Tigrins Versteck innen. Mal gucken, ob sie da da ist. I don't think so. I don't want to turn into stone. Okay, warte mal, bevor wir mit der reden. Wow, that's a big candle. Looks important for a nonsensical superstition that is. <lacht> Those are a serious fire hazard. Oh yeah. Your regular household supplies. Salt, butter, monkey skulls. Ja, oh klar. boy. An octopus. Something that can only be a human skull. A jar of eyes and a big wheel of cheese. Everything you need to make this place as creepy as possible. And shoes. Can't miss those. Mm -hmm. If that thing starts moving, I'm out of here. <laughs> ja. Bin ich ganz bei deiner, auf deiner Seite, Ted. It's covered with voodoo newspapers and voodoo cardboard. Magical. Oh, yeah. Die Tür interessiert uns nicht. Okay, ich denke, wir werden mit Tigrin reden. If it isn't Teddy Bear, the famous detective, you finally come to see me. You need my help or you need a change of perspective? There's no hiding things from you, is there? Tigrin knows everything, Teddy Bear. Then you know why I came to see you. You need my help to get the girl back from King. Wow, that's... that's exactly why I'm here. And what made you change your mind about seeking me out? You're running out of options, little bear. Listen, I'll be straight with you. All this voodoo mumbo-jumbo. I'm not really buying it. <laughs> Do I look like a saleswoman to you? Fair enough. I need your help. No one knows King better than you. Hmm. I don't know King anymore. He has lost his mind. Was there ever a time where he was, you know, sane? He is afraid, Bear, as we all are. Things have changed. From King's perspective, he is doing everything he can to save the city. To save himself. Even if that means handing Amber over to... The Red Man. <gasps> yeah, that's the plan. She's over there right now, entertaining his guests while he looks for his new buddy. Once he gets there, I don't know what's going to happen. The meeting between the two is inevitable, Bear. King wants to force it, but the girl will only face him once she is ready, not before. Until then, you have to take her out of the city. Deeper into the city she goes, and longer she stays, more difficult it would be for her to return. I don't have time for your riddles, goddammit. She's in danger. You are so backwards, Teddy Bear. You can't see what's right in front of you. The girl and the city, they share but one soul. And something is destroying her from the inside. Okay, weißt du denn irgendwas über Flint? What about her brother? She won't leave until we find him. The boy is not here, Bear. Are you sure? Where the hell is he? No one seems to know anything about the kid. There is but one man who could know where the boy is. Red. The red man and the girl are connected in more ways than one. They are on two sides of the same coin. Things she doesn't know, he knows. And things he's missing, she owns. Okay, und wie kriege ich Amber vom König wieder zurück? How do I get Amber back from King? King has a weakness. The one I'm inclined to help you exploit. As long as these flames are lit, King cannot be harmed. So you're protecting him? Why are you doing this? 
You don't owe him anything anymore. King and I shared a strong bond, the one of the flesh and the soul. Traces of our bond can still be felt by both him and me. Also, I can't let him die until I make him change his will. Huh. Even the powerful Tigran Jones is not above the earthly things like money, it seems. It's only my money I'm after, Bear. Even the powerful Tigran Jones needs to eat, huh? <laughs> All right. So, can you help me? I can. Hmm. Okay. Will you help me? It is done. That's it? I don't feel like explaining all of this mumbo-jumbo to you, Teddy Bear. King is not under my protection anymore. Go and do what you need to do. And if I kill him? Ah, with my help or without, you'll find King won't be easy to take out. Okay, uh, was weißt du denn über den roten Mann? Red, what do you know about him? Oh, I know as much about him as I know about you. I'm not sure how to feel about this. Can you stop being so damn cryptic? and give me a straight answer for a change. The past, present, and the future of the one you call Red is not up to you to know. Amber. The girl knows everything. She's just forgotten. What does he want with Amber? We will see when the time comes. Of course. Well, this was as helpful as a kick in the head. Get the girl out of the city, Bear. You don't have much time left. She won't listen to me. She's looking for her brother. And unless I can somehow convince her he's not here, there's little I can do to change her mind. Wait, what do you mean we don't have much time left? Tonight, look for the rose petals in the wind. If you are not with her still when you see them, you might just die of a broken heart. Well, that's just great news. Ah, news is news, regardless of your opinion on them. That's the way the cookie crumbles, huh? Stop speaking in riddles, Ted. Ha, <laughs> huh, good one. Anyways, it's not like I don't like hanging around creepy voodoo dens, but there's a damsel in distress waiting for me. Go and help her, teddy bear. Before I leave, I just want to check something. CBG gave me this thing he found at the steel mill after the fire. Do you know what it is? This is nothing but a worthless trinket. But your friend has too many bats in his head. Who knows where he found that? It's not a voodoo thing. It's not. You think King had something to do with this? Not anymore. I think I might have some other ideas about who burned down the mill. Yours is a world full of mystery and intrigue. Yeah, I'm really blessed. Anyways, it's been a blast. Don't stay up too late. <laughs> I like you, teddy bear. You have a kind heart. Be safe now. You're all right, too. See you around. Okay. We have only the level 6 sword and the Schweizer Taschenmesser. Um... Können wir noch was mit ihr bereden, wo wir gerade mal da sind? Why are you still here? Time is not your friend. You got that right. Okay, dann äh, gehen wir mal lieber wieder. Äh, gehen nach Paper City. Das ist die Frage, wo... Ah, wir können... Ah, okay. Dann würde ich schon sagen, wir gehen ins Casino, oder? Kommen wir da jetzt irgendwie wieder rein? Oh, guck mal einer an. The girl, Ted. She really is something else. At least we can agree on that. You don't seem to be surprised to see me here. As I already told you, there's not much going on in this city that I don't know about. So, you probably know where I went in the meantime. Did she? Did she agree to help you? She did. Doesn't matter anymore. You can have the girl back. Why the sudden change of heart? It was stupid of me to think I could change the fate of this city. We owe everything to the girl. And if repaying that debt means we have to suffer in her place, then so be it. Doesn't have to be like this, King. You're a powerful man. Help me. Help me get this red bastard. <laughs> you haven't met this guy, Ted. There is no stopping him. Why did you agree to help him in the first place? <laughs> I thought I had no choice, Ted. That thing is going to destroy the entire goddamn city. What is he? He is everything you and I aren't. He is the antithesis to everything and everyone in this city. He is our undoing, Ted. Wow. You really were married to Tigran Jones. Would it kill you two to make sense sometimes? You will understand when the time is right. And when will that be? That's... Up to the girl, when she's ready. Did you tell your new buddy to come here tonight? What'll happen to you now that she'll be gone? 
Seeing as you got Tigran to remove the spell from me, I'm not really optimistic about my chances, Ted. But don't worry. It's time to teach that red-hooded freak what happens when you try to threaten the king. You just get her out of this place, Ted. Get her out of this damn city. I'll try. You were always a thorn in my side, Bear. But I'd be lying if I said I didn't respect you. You just give him hell tonight. Oh. Oh, I intend to. So long, King. Dead. Okay. Nur die Frage, wo ist jetzt Ember? Ach da. Oh, und sie ist mit Teddy zusammen. Sehr gut. Ich dachte, wir müssen jetzt noch suchen. So now what? We need to get out of the city, doll. Start fresh in the morning. What are you talking about? I'm not going anywhere until I find Flint. This is why we came here in the first place. Flint's not here. There's nothing here. We need to go back. It was a mistake coming here in the first place. So, all of this, it was a waste of time? I wouldn't call it a total waste, but it's not safe for you here. Oh, so now suddenly you're worried about my safety? Suddenly. You didn't want to come with me in the first place, remember? Then you dragged me to Paper City and now you're telling me we should go back? Well, I'm not going. Oh, and I suppose I should just stick around and wait for someone to shoot me, because I can see it coming a mile away. Ugh, you're just being paranoid. Maybe Betty was right. Maybe what happened to CBG is happening to you now. I'll pretend you didn't just say that. Besides, did you forget we were just held captive by a notorious criminal? I need to get you away from this place, doll. No! I'm staying! I'm going to follow my leads for a change, and I'm going to find Flint with or without you. You can go back to your sad office you love so much. Oh, wow. You think I love being cooped up in that place? Has it ever crossed your mind? I set my office there so I can... What? Forget it. You're acting like a child, Amber. Anyways, it's clear to me you don't trust me anymore. And I'm positive you didn't tell me everything you know about this case. So, seeing as you believe I'm slowing you down, I wouldn't want to be a burden on you. <gasps> You've... you called me by my name. What are you saying? I'm saying this is the point in the movie where we part ways, doll. Wait, you're really going to leave me here? Alone? Frankly, my dear, I... Don't you dare quote movies at me. Hey, this is your city, right? No one is safe here more than you. But what about the Red Man? You know what? Fine, leave. It's not like I really need you anymore. I'm capable of doing things on my own. I figured as much. Just wanted to hear you say it. Well, see you around, doll. Oh nein. Oh nein, das finde ich gar nicht gut. Und da kommen die Rosenblätter. Ted, come back. Please. Er hat das Geflüsterte gehört. Sie hat es zum Meer hinausgeflüstert. Ted, come back. Bear with me. Ende von Episode 2. Nein, jetzt haben sich Ted und Ember getrennt. Oh, das finde ich gar nicht gut. Und die Rosenblätter flogen, wo Tigran Jones ja gesagt hat, wenn er dann nicht mehr bei ihr ist, dann ist alles Kacke, mehr oder weniger. Und das ist jetzt passiert. Ganz am Ende haben wir das gesehen. Und oh, mir ist das Herz aufgegangen, als sie da so flüstert. Flüstert, so dass sie, Er kann das auf gar keinen Fall hören. Sie flüstert das zum Meer hinaus. Come back. Oh, Herz zerreißend. Justin Dorp hat aber viele Stimmen, äh, viele Rollen. Daniel Pierce ist der, der Reef King, okay, der, der coole Stimme. Ich 
Ich hoffe, es wird noch erwähnt, wann die nächste Episode kommt. Okay, scheinbar nicht. Gut, das war es also mit der zweiten Episode Bear With Me. Ich denke mal, in ein paar Monaten bis zum halben Jahr wird es wahrscheinlich die dritte Episode geben. Ich hoffe, dass es sie geben wird. Äh, bitte kauft euch dieses Spiel. Kauft euch die ersten beiden Episoden, damit die nächsten Episoden gesichert sind. Es, ich finde es wirklich so toll, dieser Film Noir, dieser Humor, diese Anspielung, diese süße Ember und dieser knallharte Teddy Bear, die zusammen einfach... Ein Dream Team. Ich danke euch sehr fürs Zusehen. Ich hoffe, ihr hattet viel Freude, Freunde. Bis zum anderen Let's Play am Lars Team mit Rechtschreibfehlern oder bis zur dritten Episode von Bear With Me. Macht's gut. Tschüsschen!